Okay, so here we show you how this uh, use uh, C like a programming to drive a robot. Um, okay, so you can see uh, over here uh, there is a few coding. Uh, use this coding, you can drive the hardware port uh, in the robot and then uh, drive the, uh, uh, the robot car to move. Okay, so uh, it looks a few uh, stuff here, so we can explain this uh, line by line. On uh, the fourth one, you can see we just define a uh, move time, so it's, uh, it's a variable. So we define like a 2000, so actually the unit is a millisecond, so actually it's a uh, 2 second. And we also define the turn time is uh, 1 second. And it's just like the C programming at the start, you need to define the start. Okay, you define a task, a main. Okay, so this is a, a line 4 to line 13. This is a main programming. Okay, on the fourth uh, here on the line 5, so this actually do is a loop. It repeated this, um, the content below it in here, the line 7 to line 10 repeated those uh, four times. And what it does is just to drive the robot to move a square. Okay, so we can see on here is on forward. Uh, this command just to drive the hardware port uh, A and C, the output A and C. Okay, so we use A and C to drive on each side of the robot car. Uh, the A is on the engine on the left, the C is engine on the right. So we drive this, um, uh, both engines is go to a uh, straight line. And uh, 75, that means the power number. So it's not 100%, it's drive 75%. Okay, then you have a timer here. You keep continue, execute this command until we wait for those time. We wait for those time is two seconds. After we wait those time, uh, it will uh, execute the other. Uh, command here. So this is on uh, ref. It's actually is backward. So move this car backward, but only on one side. See, it's output C only. So that's basically does is just make a turn. Okay, and you just have another time to wait. So this time is one second. If you change this time, you can see that if you got more time here, it's just turn more. If it um, has a less time here, it's just turn less. So if you put a one second here, and you can see it just make a 90 degree turn. Okay, so after it uh, uh, executed this command here, it's go back to here because it called repeat four times. And uh, basically it's a do a square, and uh, you just turn the engine off. So it does just a turn, uh, make the turn um, to make a square and uh, turn the engine off. Okay, so after you do this, you need to, like uh, the other programming, you need to compile it. The compile is uh, compile this language to uh, some of the hardware language, so it can drive the robot. It's also check uh, is any error you made in the programming, any the format you put is not correct. And uh, for example, you can see if you put some number that makes sense, see this number should be a uh, number 75%. If you put some other thing like uh, uh, maybe you put uh, a D D some kind of those, and you can compile. It show error here, okay? You see, okay, the compile failed because some error here. It give you some hint uh, here. The line nine, okay. The line nine have some errors. You check back to to the line nine. Some of those uh, format is not right, okay? So it um, tell you something wrong here. So you need to uh, figure out. So here is just remove this. So that should uh, make sense. So you, so so now we just uh, save that and we do a compile. Okay. Now I didn't show anything. That means it just passed. So it's okay. So then you uh, use a USB uh, cable to connect this computer to a robot. After that, you can uh, you can download it and also you can download and run it. Okay, 
So let's see uh, um, the robot if uh, does the same thing we expect. Okay. So let's see. Okay. Okay. Just make turn and turn and turn four times. Okay. So it does four times, and um, that's exactly what we want on those uh, uh, the coding. Okay, so it does um, uh, perfect. And also, you can do is so uh, we can use uh, another um, command to detect the sensor. The robot have a sensor, so you can read the sensor from the port and uh, uh, judge the distance and uh, judge the color and uh, judge the if we touch anything. So you can do a lot of stuff here. Um, then basically you can do more coding. Uh, I think that's all for today, and uh, we can talk about something uh, later on. But that's for today. Thank you.